for this one, no VAR. Some of you may be relieved with that. And there is goal line technology. But the Dutch wearing that famous orange and England in white. The Dutch with that victory under their belt against England already. And the two sets of players take the knee under the arch. Well, away we go. There will still be one more group game after Kelly. And the first break forward for Lucy Bronze. And now Lauren Hemp. And Lauren James is briefly free in the middle. And Hemp may look for James. She does get a head to the ball. But over it goes. Well, good start. Good break by Lucy Bronze on the inside. You see Hemp. Back to her Chelsea teammate Charles. Charles towards the back post. Too much chance to get too much for Kelly in the end. But you'll be keeping an eye on that left-hand side, won't you, Emma? Well, I think good start, good switch of play, good link-up from James and Charles. They're looking to be precise with their passing. Bronze goes long, and this is awkward at the back. And Dijkstra calmly done in the end. Well, it's the right decision by Dijkstra. Is... Next year, here's James sliding it into him. Hemp shot saved. That Domsala got across. Oh, what a save by Van Domsala! Well, the goal kick's been given here. Oh, no chance. It's a fantastic save. You can see it from here. I mean, that was going in. Brilliant play from Lauren Hemp, and not for the first time. That little run across the face of speed. Oh, first chance here for the Dutch to really get forward. Palova, that's not a bad ball at all. Bernstein is in and the numbers are up here. England are stretched and the Dutch score. Strike early, a huge blow for England and their Olympic hopes. But what a moment for the Netherlands. It is, but so disappointed to be beaten by a single ball in behind the back line. There was failure to get pressure out wide here with Pullover. Greenwood gets tight on the inside. Charles can't prevent the cross. And Lucy Bronze, she's asleep on the far side. She's got a tuck round. But let's give credit to Pullova. It is a wonderful pass. And Berenstein does the rest. But I think Bronze could have anticipated that ball a little quicker. A player earning her 99th cap tonight. Lynette Bernstein with a... So Brooks allowed time and they've got so many numbers up as well. England stretched again. And the shot goes wide from Van der Donk. A real quality play from Brooks, but look at Bronze's positioning again. So much space, space to exploit. Carter steps out well. To be taken by Spitzer. Rips it towards the back post. Bronze gets it away, but not too far. And it's hooked back in again off the crossbar. Spitzer. Just still not clear, and James across. So, so important for England not to concede. It really is. And you see from the ball from Rod, it's just a crack. Kirby breaks to James. Good touch from Lauren James. Charles in space to her left. James goes herself. And she earns the right to go herself sometimes, but the option was there. That's where I think England need her. I think in this moment in time, she's so press resistant. Look how she gets away from players. Running at the back three. Yes, she gets underneath it, but look what it does for the crowd. Ready. Mary Earp's watchful. Will Spitzer shoot or cross it? She shoots, and over it goes. Oh, ambitious, to say the least, from there. 
but Pulova again running at the heart of the English defence. He plays here. All Carter can do is put that ball forward. Martins. Bernstein. This is trouble for England again. Looking for a second. And it's through. Big, big, big problems for England. It's a long way back from here. Two for Lynette Bernstein. And are they too good for the Lionesses at the moment? Yes, is the honest answer at this moment in time anyway. But it's a clearance. Don't secure the first and the second ball. And now 1v1 again. And this player's been absolutely brilliant. Yeah, arguably uh, should do better, but it's too easy to get into England's box, get the shot off. And I wonder if she'll go to the bench now to put Russo into the game. I think if they've got any chance of getting back into it, then she should. And Mary Earps, but here's Stamway. They're desperate for something. Kelly strikes, oh, not that far away. Oh, what a great effort from Chloe Kelly. Initially, I thought she was going to slide Lucy Bronze into the game. Inches away. Kelly. The quality is out there for England to score goals in this game. Charles. Lauren James looks to curl one, but that's comfortable for Van Domsela. Well, at least it was sustained pressure. The starter it just needs an England goal from an England point of view. In goes the free kick. Oh, headed wide, Lucy Bronze. Probably the player England want those chances to fall to, but wide it goes. Well, that's a good ball into a good area. Look at the numbers. They, the Netherlands defend the central area. Plenty of white shirts forward. Lauren James, that's not a bad ball. Still haven't cleared their lines effectively here. Bronze, and the shot taken on by Kirby. Referee, actually. And Martins can't shrug off Bronze. Half-time, a miserable first half at Wembley for England. Thanks to some, some sharp Netherlands play, and two goals for Lynette Bernstein, the second of which Two clear goals as it stands at the moment. They are going out of the Nations League. Your commentary team, Emma Hayes, alongside Seth Hutchinson. All that used to make an impact. So does Lauren James. Lauren James setting it towards me. Oh, great for him. That midfield, England winning it back. Bronze laying it into Kirby. And James went for the reverse pass. The shot was there. I don't know why Lauren James didn't shoot from there, but good anticipation this time from Lucy Bronze. You can see the pass. Beth Mead, that's a good ball. Kirby hooking it back inside when maybe the shot was on for her as well. Hemp does very well indeed. Kirby, James can't keep it down. Well, I think that's been James in front of goal all night. Nothing on target. And just lacking that bit of confidence inside the box. As you said, they're either hooking on, making an extra pass, and there's the opportunity to shoot from both Kirby and James. James tries to play that ball, and that's not a bad ball! A goal back! Stanley! Game on for England! And straight away they grab that ball and take it back to the centre spot. A lifeline. Well, that's where you want to see Georgia Stanway. Really good play. Switch the ball out to that left-hand side. Charles further forward this half, and James where you want her, more central. And a brilliant header. She just heads the ball back across from where it came from. Impossible for, for Van Donselaar. And game on. Gets it back. Out it goes to Charles. That's not the best pass, but Charles keeps it alive. And Charles inside Meads. 
Will this break for England? It might do! It yes. does! Hemp 2-2! Two, two. And England are right back in this one. And the hopes of reaching the Nations League finals is still alive. Wow, what a great team goal that was. Just various different phases. Charles does well again. This is brilliantly well taken from Beth Mead. And I think that combination from Kirby sets it up so well. And finally, England have numbers forward. So they're able to control the both the first and the second phases. That's a brilliant finish. Celebrated by the to Morgan. Bronze. Time to just clip it in here. This is promising in towards Russo. They just lost their way a bit, the Netherlands. They had the ball and a player down. And they might be stretched as Mead almost getting it behind the so well. That's a risky ball from Brooks across and Hemp collects from Kasparai. Hemp turns almost got through. Walsh never scored for England. What a moment that would have been to score. But her positioning is so much higher. And England's counter press the entire second half has been better. Look at Walsh's stuck position. She's in an happens we are going to have a very strong final four as well. Ball clipped into that box, Bernstein going up for it. Rola keeping it alive, and then Brooks flashing it over. The player who has scored. Bronze inside, Toon. That's not a bad ball, helped on by James. Here's Hemp. Can Hemp pick the pass? Mead! Attacked it, but wide it goes. Oh, really good play from England. From back to front. What a cross-field pass from... Kira Walsh out to Lucy Bronze. And here, a little dink from Lauren Hem. You've seen me do this so many times in her career. And it just gets under it. Hold that ball up, Toon. Looking to secure it, Toon. Good work, the Black Dead! Oh, I thought it might squirm in, but no, it's a corner. Oh, certainly worth the risk. It's great feet from Toon in here. The Dutch will just sit up, but it hasn't come yet. Here's Lauren James. Here's Russo on the turn. Goes for the shot, but drags it wide. Needed an extra pass. Good build again. James and Russo combining. There are options. See Tooney's position. Oh, so many orange shirts back. Hemp. Can she pick the cross? It's not the worst cross in the world, but it's going to bounce into the arms of Van Domsela. Five. Bronze can't rescue the ball. Van der Sanden did well. Martins, Martins to win it. Ertz keeps her out. Near the dangers when you're 1v1. If you lose your individual battle, see Martins running off of Walsh. The chance of a, a goal being Hemp, James. James, Toon is arriving! What a turnaround for England! And Ella Toon at it again at Wembley. And that's why I like Lauren James in that position. The quality of that pass. Then add the quality of the run. The Dutch team been so passive in the second half. Look at the numbers on the back post. Two never gives up on it. Keeps her eye on it the entire time. And showing once again what a fabulous sub she is for England. That's the chance to be quite the hero for England. Will it be Mead? Oh, the shot is blocked. Hemp. James. Clips it in. Russo! He attacks it. It goes wide. Oh, what a great second half from England. Players can't do any more. They've been absolutely superb.
This is a top Dutch team. And Russo, been on the pitch 35 minutes, she's been out. Bronze, nearly played the five minutes. Will this be the last chance? Well, time is blown just before. It's not over for England. They've given themselves a chance still, but they couldn't find enough in the end, despite an incredible turnaround in the game to win it. They were 2-0 down in the game. Lynette Bernstein with two goals in the first half. They came roaring back in the second, the England Lionesses. Stanway, Hemp and Toon with three goals, but they needed four in the end. It's a strange end to the game because the Dutch haven't qualified yet and England still have a chance of qualifying. It's still in the Netherlands' hands, but it does go down to the final game after a brilliant game. England three, the Netherlands two.